Hey everyone, today I want to address a popular question that we often get about uh, people trying to use power inverters to back up their sump pumps with the automatic transfer switch and battery charger integrated. Um, they want to know how long the power inverter will run off one battery or how do you determine how long it's going to run depending on the size of the battery. So the first thing we always recommend is that once you get your inverter you set it up and you simulate a blackout by pulling the plug from the wall. It's good to do when your pump is draining. This way you'll have a good sense of how long it's going to run with that one battery that you purchased. Usually we recommend you know, a standard battery around 100 amp hours. And this way you'll get a good gauge on how long it's going to run between charges. And then if you don't feel comfortable with that runtime, you could always add a secondary battery in parallel and third or fourth or fifth, as many as you want to run and how often in your area the power goes out to determine on how, many, how much battery reserve you want to have with your power inverter to back up your sub pump. Um, if you have any questions about going into further detail as far as how to connect the batteries or exactly how many batteries you're going to use depending on the amp hours versus we do have a guide on our website that shows how long a power inverter will run off of a, bat a particular size battery based on the amp hours. So you can look at that guide as well. Or if you have any questions, feel free to contact us at info at powerinverters.com or give us a call. Thank you. Have a great day.